And staying with technology, a new global state-of-the-art undersea internet cable system is due to start operating in Asia and Europe. A consortium of 19 telecom operators from 18 countries, including Turk Telecom International, officially launched the project at a ceremony in Istanbul. Let's take a closer look. And as part of the project, Turk Telecom International has built a high-capacity submarine data network in the Aegean resort town of Marmaris. Christine Pirovalakis spoke to the company's chairman, Mehmet Toros. He explained why the project is important for Turkey. CNV5 is the biggest project, biggest submarine project in the world at the moment, launched in, at the end of uh, last year. So today we are launching officially and commercially today. This is the longest one from uh, Asia, from Singapore, all the way through to uh, Europe. This is, the, this is the major differentiation of CMV5 cable systems from the others. And there is one other thing. So this is the fastest cable systems comparing to the others. And uh, there are many other landing stations in, in all over the world. What role did Turkey play in this project? We are one of the member countries, member operators to CMV5 cable systems. And we have the landing stations in Marmaris, which is the southern part of Turkey on the Mediterranean coast. So having this uh, opportunity, landing station, so Turkey will be the data hub, internet hub in between Asia and Europe, specifically Istanbul and also the west coast of uh, Turkey, west, west coast of Turkey. So we are providing alternative route. If there is any problem, uh, hopefully there will be no problem uh, in the submarine, submarine part of this cable. So we will, we will get into the service immediately to back up all the internet uh, traffic. How vulnerable are these cables to attacks? This cable, having the equipment and also software, it is, it is proven to the attacks. So that's why it is more secure than the others. But of course, uh, there is no boundaries uh, for the attacks. So that's why the all member countries, member operators uh, has realized their uh, security systems and the security softwares uh, prevent from any, uh, any attacks outside of the world, of course. 